Susano, protect me. Dead bodies. Who killed these people? A fearsome warrior. He demanded I tell him the tale of Shigenori's heavenly strike. When he didn't hear the answers he sought, he flew into a rage and butchered them. What did he want to know? I am not sure, my lord. Tell me the story. I need to know what he's after. When Tsushima was first settled, a strange and terrible thunderstorm swept across our island. Wherever lightning struck, beasts of lightning appeared. These violent creatures tore through villages, causing death and destruction, moving too quickly to be stopped. The people knew only one man who could possibly stand against the lightning beasts, Shigenori. The fastest swordsman in all of Tsushima, Shigenori, never lost a duel. With years of practice, he had created the Heavenly Strike, an attack that struck quicker than the eye could follow. Shigenori lured the creatures to a desolate beach in Komatsu, where the sand would slow their movement. Their clash turned the sand to ash, and bleached the leaves of trees white. Shigenori's heavenly strike cut through them faster than they could move. As the final beast fell, the storm cleared, and Tsushima was safe again. Shigenori began a life of seclusion. Few students found him, and only the bravest and most skilled proved worthy of learning the heavenly strike. When a storm approaches, a sword is placed at Shigenori's rest by a student who knows of its location to ward off attacks from beasts of nature. The murderer wishes to learn Shigenori's heavenly strike. It sounds dangerous in the wrong hands. Which way did he go? A woman fled toward a nearby bridge. He chased her. He'll answer for what he did here. That's the bridge the musician mentioned. Someone weeping. Where? My lord, so many, slaughtered. Did you see the man who killed them? I know who he is, Yasuhira Koga. I've heard the name. He fought for the Yarikawa clan. Would you recognize him? I'll never forget that leering face. 
Follow me. Perhaps I can pick up his trail on the other side of the bridge. Horse tracks. Yasuhiro was in a hurry. What more do you know of Yasuhiro Koga? Only that he was a retainer for the Yarikawa clan years ago. After the rebellion was crushed, the clan was dissolved and retainers dismissed. Rumor says he left Tsushima, but when the Mongols attacked, he returned. From where, I'm not sure. It doesn't matter. He cannot be allowed to live after what he's done. Up ahead, they're constructing a roadblock. Mongols, hide yourself. Face me first!
Yasuhira Koga anywhere. We're pursuing a man named Yasuhira Koga. He just left. He's been staying in the watchtower. Working with the Mongols? Yes. But last night they argued. Only made out one word. Chigenori. I'll search the watchtower. Find somewhere safe before more Mongols come. Yasuhira been doing? White leaves, like those bleached by lightning in the tail. The Mongols have their own version of Shigenori's tail. Maybe he wanted to compare it to the musician's version. A dueling ring. He's looking for it. Yasuhira is looking for someone who can teach him Shigenori's heavenly strike. The white leaves. There are trees like that not far from here. That's where he went. You've helped enough. Get to safety with the others. Thank you, my lord. I hope you punish that monster.
Need to find white-leafed trees. Lord Shimra, after everything he's done for me, everything he taught me, I can't lose my uncle. I won't. Careful, my lord. This path is dangerous. Dangerous for a samurai, but not a priestess. What are you doing here? My duty, tending the shrines. When the war ends, people will need these Torii gates to mark their path so they can find the Shinto shrines 
and pray for the Kami's protection. We could use their protection now. Yes, but the paths are too treacherous. I tried to visit the nearby shrine, almost fell to my death. Maybe I can reach it. As a boy, I climbed every tree and cliff around my village. If you get there in one piece, pray for our island, and take an Omamori charm for yourself. Wear it close, and the charm will change your fate. And perhaps the fate of our home. Thank you. Follow the Torii gates. They will lead you to shrines all across our island, and the Omamori charms that rest there. So peaceful here. What is this place? My lord, please go inside. Lord Jinroku will be back soon. I thought you were Lord Jin Loku, but you're another samurai. Welcome, my lord. Another samurai? You haven't heard of Lord Jinroku? He's a legendary samurai. I'd like to meet him. When will he return? Soon. Join us for dinner. Perhaps he'll share one of his grand stories with you. I wasn't expecting a visitor. We're happy to have you, of course. Hmm. Thank you. I didn't realize any other samurai had survived. It was a fierce battle, wasn't it? The beaches of Komatsu ran red with blood that terrible day. 
We fought at Komoda. <laughs> of course. Forgive me. I'm tired from a long ride. Please, have Nabe show you the bath. We can speak more over dinner. Please follow me, my lord. How much do you know of Lord Jinroku? He tells us everything. If it wasn't for him, we would have lost the whole island. When you met him, was he armed? He gave everything to save Tsushima except his horse. It's at the stables. My bath can wait. I want to look at his horse. Farm horse. Never seen battle. Normal tools. Nothing out of the ordinary. I know this saddle. It belonged to Lord Higuchi. Shinroku is no samurai. I'll get the truth from him. Where is Jinroku? He left quickly after you went to the bath. It must have been important. I'll find him. We need to talk. Stop running, you fool! Stop! Before it's too late! I don't want to kill you. Stop! I wasn't hurting anyone. I challenge you to a duel! You want to fight me? Yes. It's the only way. If that's your wish, I accept.
I don't want to die. I surrender. I'm sorry. Tell me who you really are. I'm nobody. I was just trying to survive. You're impersonating a samurai and bringing dishonor to the name. And you're taking advantage of those women. I know. Please, my lord, let me live. I'll never go back there again. Leave. And if I ever see you wearing that armor again, we will finish our duel. Truth. <laughs>